everybody welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Jacqueline I make new videos every week whole variety of things lifestyle beauty adventure all sorts of fun stuff and I put every Monday Wednesday and Saturday um I'm currently sitting outside cats in the window puppies drinking some water just you know living the life but um it's Monday so I figured I'd start a new vlog um I'm currently cleaning my converse which I'll insert the footage of it right now Okay, one of my tasks for the day is to attempt to clean my Converse. They're so gross. I cleaned my white Nikes yesterday. They came out pretty good. There's still like a few spots on the inside that look bad, but other than that, they look really, really good. So I'm going to attempt to do the same thing to the Converse that are worse. So basically all that I have is I have this OxyClean stuff. It works really well. So I made a little bowl for the shoelaces and I have a big bucket for the shoes and I'm actually gonna scrub the shoes. I'm not gonna soak them because I did some research and it says that if you soak them, a lot of like the glue and stuff can come up and it can actually ruin your shoes. So not to soak them, but just kind of like gently scrub them. So um, these are pretty old anyway and beat up, but you know, if I can get a little bit more wear out of them, it would be nice. So um, yeah, that's kind of my plan. So I'm gonna take the shoelaces off first and put them in there, but I wanna give you a sneak peek okay i did this outside so it wouldn't be like too messy and i also did it beyond our fence so it wouldn't get it in our yard but so i just like did a really thick coat of it all over and i'm just gonna let it sit in the sun and kind of let the sun do its thing i gotta flip that one over but um yeah that's kind of what i'm doing and i will check on them later but um i'm just kind of like sitting outside now waiting i'm just gonna like let them sit in the sun for as long as i can um and then rinse them off but um yeah, I'm just kind of hanging out outside. I worked out this morning, took the puppy for a walk, did my work. Um, I might actually bring my yoga mat out here and do a little stretching, which would be nice because it's actually really comfortable outside. It's like 70 something. There's a nice breeze and our porch is already mostly in shade. So um, I might do that, but that's kind of what's happening. And I will check in with you guys later. Good morning, everybody. Happy Tuesday. I keep thinking it's a day off. Like, I keep thinking it's Wednesday. You know, it's Tuesday. Yesterday, I kept thinking it was Tuesday, even though it was Monday. Anyway, um, me and Tahoe are out on our morning walk. I already worked out, jump roped, and then I got a bunch of filming to do. So, that's kind of the plan for the day. I just wanted to check in and say hi because it's so beautiful outside. I figured I'd do my first check in outside. So, I will check in with you guys later. All right, I'm ready for the day. I put on new jewelry that. I've had forever. I love this little thing. It's a piercing here and then it's just a cuff. So you don't have to have a piercing up here, which is nice. I mean, I already have a lot of piercings, but it's always fun to, you know, fake another one. Um, but I'm all ready for the day. Um, and so I'm going to actually film my monthly favorites now, which should be good. I, this is going to be my first one that we are like fully self-isolated for. Um, sorry, I need coffee. So it's going to be interesting to see what's on my list um the favorites should already be up by the time this vlog goes up so i'll leave that uh, video up in whatever corner it is i still can't figure out what corner it is um and down below in case you're curious about that video um but also there's a very cute sleepy puppy per usual it's his favorite spot um but it's supposed to be really nice out today so yeah, we'll see what else I get up to, but I definitely want to film that video so I can get it done and I don't have to put on makeup <laughs> another time this week. I try to film my videos like on the same like one or two days. That way I don't have to get ready, like put on makeup and stuff more than when I need to because I, um, I love putting on makeup and I love wearing makeup, but I just don't feel the need to do it every single day. I like my natural skin, so you know. Um, but yeah, that's kind of my plan right now. So I'm going to gather up all of my favorite stuff and film that, and I will check in with you guys a little bit later. So cute. 
Um, I just finished filming and yeah, I'm gonna take a break, edit a video, get it uploaded, stuff like that. But I wanted to show you Tahoe's cute puppy dream. Um, and yeah, I guess I'll just talk with you guys later. Okay, good morning, everybody. I recorded this clip in my garage originally, but it was super echoey and the lighting is horrible. So I'm just recording it really quick before I show you my workout. So basically what you're about to see is my leg workout. I'll show you my um, arm workout tomorrow or my upper body workout tomorrow. Um, but basically what I have done is I've got seven exercises. I do each of them for 30 seconds a piece. Um, like, so if it's like a one-sided thing, I'll do 30 seconds one side, 30 seconds the other, if that makes sense. Um, and I do that, like I do all seven exercises and then take a minute break and that ends up being six minutes. So each round is six minutes long. Um, and so I do four rounds and that's 24 minutes total. Um, so I'll put the workouts right here on the screen right now so you can screenshot it if you want to. Um, but also obviously I'm gonna show you me doing it. Um, what else did I wanna say about it? I don't remember. Then after the 24 minutes, I do like 15, 20 minutes of jump roping outside. And I usually take Tahoe for a walk for a little bit too. So that's kind of my morning exercise routine right now. Um, and I don't do these exercises to lose weight or to be skinny. I just like working out. Um, it makes me feel strong and I enjoy working out and lifting weights. Um, I'm not a certified trainer. I am not a medical professional in any way or anything like that. I just enjoy working out and I, um, even before all the coronavirus craziness, I'd work out five days a week anyway. So I just was kind of trying to figure out how I wanted to do it at home. And this is what I've come up with and it's been working for me. So I want to share it with you guys. Um, so yeah, let's just hop into my leg workout. I'll put a little timer up on the screen too, so you can see um, how long everything's taking me. So yeah, let's do it.
morning, everybody. The first thing I wanted to share with you is my upper body workout. Just as with my leg workout, <laughs> there are, um, I don't know how many exercises. So there are nine exercises in this upper body workout. Um, I forgot to mention yesterday that I do use some bands and some, um, I use like a stack of bricks all taped together as a weight. You can do any of these just body weight um, with a band, with a weight, whatever you want to do. Um, same with the upper body, you can, you know, do it however you want. I think they would still work. Um, but yeah, same thing as with the lower body day. I do the nine exercises, 30 seconds each. Um, if it's double sided, obviously I do 30 seconds one side, 30 seconds the other. E, uh, total for five minutes and then I get a minute break so six minutes each round and I usually do about four rounds um so yeah I'm gonna share that with you right now
Okay, the other thing I wanna share, first of all, the house is clean, I just finished cleaning. Yes, I love a clean house on a Friday. Um, and the other thing I wanted to share is that I'm getting a couple packages today. One of them is my Wink box, my first subscription from Wink. I'm so excited. So I'll show you when you get it, when I get it. And the other ones are from Amazon. Um, I just got a few things, a couple skincare. Matt needed something for our weed whacker. And um, we got a ball for Tahoe. And I got some dry erase markers. So I'll figure, I'll show you those when I get them too. Um, but yeah, also today is a very exciting day. It's May 1st, by the way, it's Friday. And um, my amazing husband is a captain today. I'm so excited. He just got promoted to a captain. I'm so proud of him. He did, he's such an amazing man. Um, but anyway, we are gonna have a little at-home celebration, just the two of us, because we were supposed to have his parents come down. We're gonna have a little party and stuff, but obviously that's not happening. There, he's not even having a ceremony as of right now. Um, but he is officially a captain today, so I'm really proud of him. Um, so he just ran to the grocery store to get a few things. I don't know what we're gonna do for dinner, but he got a special scotch for himself. Uh, we got some champagne to celebrate just the two of us at home. So hopefully, you know, it will still be special and I'm just really proud of him. So that's kind of the plan for the day. So I will show you guys later. Okay, I just wanna share one thing with you really quick. I made these peanut butter cookies that are really good. I found the recipe on Pinterest, but basically you just use one um, box of like yellow cake mix. I found a gluten-free cake mix from King Arthur. King Arthur, really good. Um, they make really good gluten-free products. Um, two eggs, a cup of peanut butter, and half a cup of oil. I added a little bit of extra oil to mine, and then I added mini M&Ms and dark chocolate chips. And oh my God, they came out so good. Look at these, they taste amazing too. They came out so good and Matt even tried them and they're, we're just both like super impressed with how they came out. They're not too sweet. They're perfectly soft and chewy and mm -mm, they're so good. We got Tahoe this new soccer ball and it's, it's supposed to be like, in, oh yep, he's here. Okay, back to this, I got my wine. But we got Tahoe this soccer ball. It's supposed to be like indestructible. Matt, pick it up for a second and show. Um, Let me see it. Tahoe's really liking it though. We've had it out here for a few minutes now and he's really enjoying it. So basically it like has a hole and if you squeeze it, the air goes out and then we let it go, this air goes back in. So it's like, you can't put holes in it because it's a really thick plastic and he is loving it. I'll leave a link to it in down below. It's from Amazon, but he's really happy. He's still trying to figure out how to like pick it up though, which is funny, <laughs> but he's loving it. Todd, do you love it? He's a good boy. He deserved a fun new thing. He's really quick. He's a happy boy. Also, my wines just got here, so when we go back inside, I will unbox them, but I am so excited for my first wing shipment. Ah, I'm so excited. So I'll show you those in a little bit. Now it is. Can I go? Okay. I'll allow it. I'm gonna open up my wink box. Matt wanted me to open it up, even though he's not getting any. My wine. So it comes with a little booklet. Oh, that's cool. Read it to me. Well, it just tells you about wine and stuff. I'll read it later. All right. What should I start with? My whites, my reds, or my rosé? You don't care. Okay. So the first one I got is called Lost Poet. It's from California. It's a red wine. Looks very yummy. Um, I got a rosé called Summer Water. It's also from California. This is like a popular one on social media. Like I see like influencers drink this one, but I love rosé, so that's exciting. Um, this one I was really interested in. This is an Austrian wine. I don't even know how to pronounce Ventler? Your finger is in the middle of it. That's the type of wine. Veltliner. Yeah. Oh, but some sort of Austrian wine, and it looks so good. <laughs> and then I also got a Riesling from California, which I don't normally like Rieslings, but 
we'll see hopefully this is a good one this will probably be the first one i try since it's the one i'm least excited about but yeah i'm excited so those are all my wink wines there's a plastic bag over there so tahoe's very excited <laughs> oh i'll go i'll go grab it but um yeah that's all my wink wines that i got my first box and i'm really excited about it all right i'm gonna end the vlog here um we celebrated Matt's promotion this weekend, so I didn't film anything. We just, you know, hung out at the house. We watched a movie. We had a fire because it was so nice. Um, and we just didn't really do much, obviously, because we can't really do much. But um, it was just a nice little, like, date day for us, which was fun. Um, but, yeah, that's all that's going on. And hopefully you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Uh, and subscribe if you want to join our little adventure family here. And yeah, I think that's it for this video. So I will see you in my next adventure. Bye.